Oh, I don't like that. Let's get rid of this fire. I'm gonna just, oh shit, too far. Ignore my chin, okay? It looks like a double chin, and I really don't know how to sit myself to get rid of the double chin. Oh. Okay. I feel like someone's digging in my back here. The fucking wire. Oh my god. Okay. <clears throat> oh god. Goodness gracious. Anyway. Anyway. Hi everyone. How are you all doing? Welcome. Hope you're all doing well. I'm so unorganised. It's really, truly something. At times. Yes. Oh gosh. Okay, anyway. Hiya. How you all doing? I hope you're all doing well. Oh, we're back with some DVD. It's been a minute. I've missed it. I have really, really missed it. So, obviously, Ring Reset happened a few days ago. I think. When did Ring Reset happen? Three days ago? Yeah, it's the 16th. Three days ago. So, Ring Reset happened three days ago. I've done, like, the odd game here and there since Ring Reset. But, like, I haven't played enough to, like, fully... get into the gist of it, so... Um, I have played the PTB, because, although I primarily play through console, which is what I'm on currently, I have played the PTB, I did really enjoy it, and Vecna looks really fun, I did enjoy playing as Vecna, I feel like he's gonna take some getting, like, like, learning his skills, and his different spells, <clears throat> just because... He has the four options of like knowing when to use them and like prioritizing which one to use first. Like it's gonna be like a whole learning curve, which is like kind of it adds like an exciting element to the game. The same with survivors and like the mimic chests. And then the chest where you get like you roll the dice as well. It also adds like a whole new aspect to the game. Because you can't predict what number you're going to get, whether you roll a 1, or you roll a 20, or you roll in between, and get either Vecna's eye or his hand, and then obviously if you just get a standard default, um, the common tier rarity item, like a medkit or a toolbox. So, it's very exciting, I'm very intrigued, I'm looking forward to the fun of the game, I'm so excited for it. The PTD was a lot of fun, as I say. I played it for a bit. Didn't do much. But I did play some, and I did thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy myself playing it. So, I am... I am very... Very excited for it. To come into the game. And also Castlevania. Being, like, the, the chapter after, as well, is very exciting. Like, for finally getting... Like, a, an icon of horror, I would say, is in, like, a vampire coming to the game, which is quite cool. Like, it's definitely been a long time coming. I'm so sorry. I feel very, very self-conscious about how I'm sitting. It's how I look. to so like, giving myself a double chin because I'm, like, leaning my head down. Or it's a mess. I'm a mess. But, we're going with it, we're thriving, we're TBDing, and we're living our best life. This is what we're here for. God. Very, oh my god, I feel very uncomfortable. But anyway, you know, we played yesterday as Johnny, and he had his little titties out. When I'm playing as David, and he's got his little titties out. So, in solidarity, the titties are out. And yeah, anyway. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Do you know, like, you haven't played a game for a while, 
and you get like like the urge to go and play it and you have that like excitement to like really dive into a game again. Gosh, I'm so excited. I'm so ready to delve in and get back into it. I wonder if my camera's are really in the way. I'm gonna I'm gonna find a place. I'm gonna find a place to shove my face cam for when I play DBD. This wire is like stabbing me in the back. I'm so sorry. I'm getting distracted. But I, I'm gonna find a, a place to put my face cam so it's not in the way. Because I feel like we need to see David. And he's like blocked by my face cam. Like we can't see him. And it's upsetting me. Anyway. Besides the point. Um, I have no idea if they're live or not, but if they are and you do happen to go over and check, regardless of how people play, remember always be kind and respectful. You know, everyone, everyone does their best. Sometimes we have off days, sometimes we have days where we just, just not doing our best, you know. I have them days, quite often. <laughs> so it's just always, you know, kind, respectful. Gotta be friendly to people. Anyway. We got this, okay? We're going to actually fry. And I'm actually gonna try my hardest to be a helpful level. Are you screaming because of... What's it called? Unnerving? It's not unnerving. What is it called? Ultimate Weapon or Steve Perk? Not Steve Perk. It's... Scene partner, plot twist. I don't know what it's called. It's one of them packs, right? When you scream. When you look at the killer. Who is that? Nemesis. A bit of a nemesis situation going on. We can do that. Okay, no. Okay. I mean, he might come back. He might not. He doesn't seem to be coming back. I feel like we're kind of safe. Oh, I feel like I've got a really fat neck. I'm so sorry. I'm really like critical of myself. Body just not. This doesn't like so not good for people's opinions on themselves. So she, she took him away from the chain. Like she took. Sorry, she took aggro. So like it meant we got the gen finished. So that was helpful. We'll make sure we go save her. Oh, that's Dwight. That's not Dwight. It is Dwight. I thought it was a zombie stuck on the pallet. But it is Dwighty Kins instead. Anywho. Dwight's right there. I feel like Dwight's gonna go for the save. Realistically, you think he would go for the save. He is just standing there. Dwight? Okay. He is going now. God. Yeah. But, you know. TBD in. I don't really have a goal. No, I do. I have. We have the challenges. I'm meant to be, I think I'm going to be going for a red glyph. I think that's what my. Challenge, time challenges, rift challenge, time, rift, rift, rift. time challenge. I think that's what I'm doing. I'm going for the red glyph. So I do need to go hunt that down at some point and kind of commandeer that. <laughs> Dead man. Dead man's and pain rooms. Okay. I can deal with that. It's not like the worst thing to happen. It's really gonna be a gem. I kind of wanna stop it regressing. 
It was tier three pain res. Not pain res. It was tier three. Dead man. I'm gonna go for the save. Do you know what? Never mind, she's already been saved. We're gonna go stop this gem from aggressing them. It was tier three dead mans that you had. Um, I know my face cam kinda of blocks that, so you wouldn't have seen. Unfortunately. I will move it. We'll find a spot. Maybe in like the bottom like the bottom left corner, like down this way somewhere. Down this way. I'm pointing as if you can see where I'm pointing with you can. We'll put it in the bottom left. No, where you can see. Because I don't tend to bring an item in with me anyway, so I feel like it doesn't really matter. Okay, you didn't pay me this. Well, now he knows me. Sorry, but your chains and whips is just not for me. But I have a good one. Let's do that too. Do you know what he hasn't? Oh, the head! Oh my god. I'm panicking. Well, now I feel bad. Well, that wasn't my intention, bitch. Leave her alone. Leave her alone, Nemesis. Thank you. I feel so bad. I didn't mean for her to go down. I don't know why she body broke the panic. Oh my god, I don't, I don't know why she got in front of the pallet. While injured as well. That seems like a silly idea. She's decisive, slay. Still kind of questioning why she got in front of the pallet. You know, again, we're not, I can't communicate with them. There's no in game chat, so. She's their own. Could have just been a simple mistake. I do feel bad. I feel like I'm going to be left. Probably now. None of them seem to be nearby. One of them. Where's the third one? One, two. She's in the locker. That's the third one. Okay. So I did not mean for her to go down at all. I don't know why she got in front of the pallet. But she did. So. Who knows? I'm just going to move from this area. This area is very polluted with survivors. I feel like we need to spread out a bit and go and work on some gems. So far we've only got the one done, so. Why did it, okay. I was trying to focus on. I mean, okay, for sure. What are we gonna do? Why oh, that's not on the gem? I don't know where she is. Do I just let herself go? Okay. Okay. This is not a loop I want to go into. There's nothing to like defend myself with. Oh, you're back. Oh gosh. 
I'm not gonna do anything. I'm not gonna think about shit. At least I probably got the save done. During that. With him chasing me. I'm not very good at looping, but we're learning. You know, practice makes perfect. No, practice makes improvement. So we're giving it a go. We're trying to see where we can get to. Oh, went? Okay. I didn't know she was there. Oh my god, my glyph. So now if we die, at least we get our glyph done. So at least we have that challenge done, which means we can move on to the next one. Why? Why? Okay. Okay, hold up. I can't see the progress bar. So I don't know how close I am to finishing. Look, I know I'm self-caring, but... It sort of sounds like he was laughing at her. It was not the intention at all. You know, I'm just. I don't really know. We're just gonna thrive and go somewhere else. Was there. Spawn and hatch in the main building. I don't know who rang the offering, but at least it was me building and not Shark, because obviously he was over there. So. First match, did I miss the game? I thought I was doing great. Ish. Doing okay ish. I didn't even pip. But. It is what it is. We do what we can. Realistically, what's the worst that could happen? So, you know. I'm going again. I'm not going to... I don't know if anyone else had noticed, but they fixed David's feet. I don't remember before, they used to like, almost, I don't know, they looked a bit crooked, but they fixed his ankles. But in doing so, they've kind of made him not as peachy, so they've sort of, fi they fixed his feet, but they've lost some of his ass in the process. So, you know, we're kind of we're kind of missing out on a bit of the bit of the David cake. So it's a win a win loss a win lose situation, I suppose you could say. Mm -hmm. Bit of a win lose situation, anyway. <clears throat> but we're having fun, anyway. Should I? You know, I really miss playing as Leon. Seeing that Leon there, I do miss playing as him. I am a Leon main. It's just the I get tunneled a lot. Because of it being P100. And it, it kind of... Puts like a dampener on the whole mood. So, maybe. Maybe I'll die Verge back into... A bit of Leon.
I didn't bring enough for it. I should have bring a blood point offering. There's three times blood points currently. Do you know what? Like, I don't know. I kind of wish I had more like skill with doing loops. I don't know who you are. I don't know who Sarah really said is. I like I probably should know who Terror Radius that is. I've played the game long enough to know. Um, I actually have no idea who that could have been. They have Lethal though. I love the sable hair. I think it comes with the butterfly outfit. I'm actually, I'm sure it's really nice. Um, I kind of want it. <clears throat> oh, I like that. Oh. Never put a new challenge on. Um, we still have the red cliff one on. I mean, blood points this much, I'm guessing them. Because we haven't got like an, an overall objective to go for. So, you want to go two gens, Leon. Thriving. Oh, Blight. Okay. You did not see me. I probably wouldn't have um, unhooked in front of him. That doesn't seem like a a wise idea. <laughs> I mean, it's not, it's not like she's gone down there. A hidden tunnel. It's a good sign. I mean, as annoying as tunneling and camping is, and slugging, they are mechanics within the game. So I can't say, I don't suppose we can fully be actively really pissed at that. It might be annoying, but like I said, they are mechanics within the game. gonna move away because I would rather not be stuck while they're trying to like loop and stuff because sometimes it's annoying and you body block people. Hi, welcome in. So we've done this gem. The other one got popped up at the top corner. I think a central gem.
Ooh. She has barbecue. I'm hoping she has the solution. Uh, I'm good, thank you. How are you? I think you're doing well. Um. So Leon's there. We can go for Leon. Just get him off. She's in a trading, I think. But we got them both off her. Guard was in trading. Which is beneficial. Shit. I cannot loop to save my life. Yeah, there's not something I can't do at all. But we've done, we've nearly done three jumps. The center one's close to finishing. I don't think he has pain rose. Any doesn't seem like he's got any gem regression. Lethal and barbecue are the only ones we know of so far. Perk wise. I'm guessing a totem he was cleansing, or he's just sitting in the corner. Over there. I don't know who that is though. That's Dwight. No, Felix. So Leon's over there. Not doing anything. Okay. I mean. Kill. Okay, he's now going on the gem. Maybe he was waiting to see if someone else was coming to get the unhook or not before jumping on the gem. I mean, if we finish this one, I'm gonna go back to send a gem and then that shouldn't free gem us. It might do, but they're gonna both be working on a gem together. We might get away with it. This table's doing really good at running him, to be fair. So I feel like I just said we're sleeping too soon. <laughs> to be fair, she ran him while injured for my unhook, the hill, and the running to the gen and popping the gen and getting back here. So, she's done, she's done well with looping, better than I can with looping. I feel like he's gone for them too, there's a barbecue. So I'm gonna go for this on her look. Leon's here too. Okay, so we can we can double heal. And the three of us get on the gem, we should be able to get a form now. I don't know where he's running Leon. Felix, I mean. Over there. I know they he's onto a different gem. Oh, he does have pain res. Oh, he's going for Sable. Hopefully, someone goes for that on her. I don't 
different. I should have been looking where I was running. Hopefully, it would have been smarter. Okay, they got the unhook. Leon should finish this gen. Providing this isn't a pain goes hook. Never mind. We, we can still get out of this. That jump is really cute with the little heart in the back. We can still... We can still get through this. Thanks. I feel like... I'm hoping we haven't free gen By me popping that gen in the centre. Being blind is a skill. I would actually cry. If like being shit at looping was a skill, I would cry for that as well. Why are you both here? I'm so confused. What do you want from me? I want to go find Leon's gen. I think it's this one. Here it is. And I found the bike. In the bike. If I can get a far enough away from him, I can heal with bite the bullet so he won't be able to find me as easily. But that does mean I need to get ahead. With him. That's the fucking wall. Never mind. Um you know, I feel like at least they should be able to get out. Hopefully. I feel like we did great. We did the best we could do with my looping skills. Which isn't a lot. But it's the best I could do. I probably could do better. But I like, really, really applied myself. But, you know, it is what it is. You know. I don't need that. I do need a red herring. I'm going to say... We'll leave distortion. We'll go with a calm spirit. For red herring. For the challenge. And then we can just put it back on afterwards. I run the same build on everyone. I'm... It annoys people that I run self-care. But it comes in so handy. For disappearing mid-chase. After having a general three seconds, if you highlight the of the yellow aura, generates this highlight until it's fully repaired. You repair a new generator or enter a locker. So what have I got to do? Have the killer come within 50 meters of a generator targeted by red herring after the pack activates within 30 seconds. So I've just got to trigger the perk when the killer's nearby. I'm guessing by the sounds of things. I don't know. Really bad with like, sometimes they word these challenges a little, a little iffy. So that's what we're going to try. We're going to just try trigger it and see. See what happens. Um. I mean, sure, why not? Kind of. No. Mm 
Turn the purple hair kind of look good. With it, in my opinion, to a degree. I'm really blind. So it might look awful. But we're going to stick with it anyway. Um, because why not? And I don't really have anyone I'm putting blood paints into, like, as a character. I'm just putting them into whoever. So. By the sounds of it, I just have to trigger Red Heron and get the killer to come to said gen. So I'm hoping. Hoping it's doable. Hopefully. Oh gosh. I do like more. I feel like we're doing, we're doing okay, I feel like, I don't know, struggle, I need to get better at looping, and then, so I'll go from there, it just takes practice, I suppose, which is not something I, I've done a lot of, practice looping wise. I'm usually dead pretty early into games. Is there a gem perfection? Ah! Ah! Well, ah! I've just got, there we go. And it was, it literally was just triggering make him come to the gen. Is that because of the frosty eyes? Or is that just how he looks now? <laughs> Has he always had them little particles coming off of him? So he has Serge. Serge or Joel? Serge, it's called Serge now. We got the name back, Serge. I don't think he kicked the gem. We did my challenge. I feel bad because it can't. Oh, he has payments too. Okay. Not a problem though. I do feel bad because in doing my challenge, I kind of got the cake downed. It was unintentional. But I did the challenge. So, my challenge is done. Which means I can thrive and just play the game normally. He has, um, is it Mindbreaker? I'm, I'm basically blinded. Blinded and exhausted. Are they just spawn counters? Okay. So the other two people weren't an issue. I'm so confused. I mean, the Steve and the Feng were like near the hook. I'm kind of slightly baffled. This is probably going to get me killed. If I had balanced landing, that would have been great. Like, let's just jet off around the corner. 
Oh my god, okay. Does the yellow gem highlight for just me, or does it highlight for everyone? Does anyone actually know? Because I didn't read the part for this. To kind of get the gist of that. You know, props for paying attention to perks. <laughs> so he likes to return to her, which is fine, no. Keep on your list. He does have sloppy as well. So I'm going to say pain res, sloppy, and mind breaker. I don't know what else has, his fourth perk is. I think it's called mind breaker. It's the one that makes you um exhausted and blind when on a gen or when working on a gen. He's no distortion perk. So I actually have no idea what his fourth one could be. He might not even have a fourth pack. He might not even have one. Mm. Okay, Steve's up. Kate is second. They're all kind of grouped over there. Oh my god, I forgot that makes this map smaller. There's like a whole entire row of buildings move missing from here. Oh, it's like, okay. So he's over that way somewhere. This is like, this would have been great. So I took off Calm Spirit. Do you want one hills? I'm oh, sorry. So I took off Calm Spirit and it ha it was a doctor, of course. Why wouldn't it be a doctor when I take off Calm Spirit? Oh, that's a wall. Or an object, should I say. Not really a wall. Has that palette always been there? Is that a fake palette? Am I really dumb? Probably really dumb. Shit. Oh my gosh. Is Steve just AFKing under that hook? No. I think there's frosty eyes, or is it just his... Has he always had these particles? I feel like he hasn't always had the particles, but if he has, then I'm really dumb. And I've just never noticed them before. I feel like they're new though, like 100% of them are going to be new. They definitely haven't always been a thing. But we did the challenge, even if we die, it's fine because I'm probably gonna die if I miss some of my skill checks. This is fine though, we did we did the challenge for like the time, the time challenge thing. So I feel awful. That wasn't even intentional. She got right there as I died. Anyway. Um do you know what? We got we got the time challenge done. That's that's the main thing. The challenge is done, so we can move on to the next one. That's that's like the most important thing here. 
if you want to get the rift stuff, like the challenges that we can do done. So. Without a pallet or window and a chase. And 40,000 blood points. I mean, I can do that. Just gonna vote one. I'm gonna put Calm Spirit back on. It, it, that was just my luck that I take Calm Spirit off. And. We get a doctor. So, I feel like we need a bit of Nancy. You know what? We're gonna go Leon. We're gonna do it. It's been a hot minute since I've been able to play as Leon. And. What am I doing? Voting a pallet or window one and chase twice. Doable. Massively doable. I'm not too concerned about doing that. I can still do it. I can vote a pallet or window. One and chase twice. I do need to work on getting everyone leveled. I want to try and get everyone to at least prestige 10 and then I will like focus more on getting my next P100. I feel like that's what my like overall goal is going to be. We'll try and get everyone to prestige 10. Mm -hmm. I feel really mean now, because... We've just got to vote one and chase twice. Which isn't, like, the most difficult thing in the world, I would say. But it can also be quite a hard one to do. If you don't know the loops. So there's a vault there. Where's Chucky? Or Tiffany? One of the two. It's gonna be one of them. Oh my god. Now as much as I need to vault the pallet or window while in chase twice, I'm not gonna intentionally try to take aggro. Um, like, at straight away at 5 gems. Because always I feel like we're going to get nowhere because no progress seems to be being made. And then it just kind of becomes a detriment to, like, the team's progress of escaping. But also, I don't want to interfere with someone's chase. Especially when I can't communicate with them. Different if you're chatting with a friend. Um... In the sense of, if I'm chatting with people, and I interfere with their chase, they, like, are aware I'm coming, and they know I'm there. But if it's a random that I can't talk to, I don't want to end up causing them to go down because I've unintentionally body blocked them. It's a cute little outfit. The little concierge. I think. I think that's what it is. I don't want to say it is. Because it could be wrong. But I think it's a little concierge out there. Like, other people will take your bags for you in a hotel. That's what he looks like. But I could be wrong. Um... I don't know where the Nia is, but obviously she has, she has Chucky, so we don't have to worry too much about him jumping us on that gen. I'm going to cleanse it now, just because you never know with no Ed. It's better to be safer than sorry. So, we're going to take it out when we see them.
just for that like added precaution. <laughs> so I feel like these leaves that are dropping down, I've never noticed them before. Like maybe I'm just, I haven't paid much attention to the details before with maps. But I don't feel like I've seen these leaves falling before. I could just be really stupid and just completely not remember seeing them at all. But then that being said, actually, on like the Yamoka map, I've never noticed the fireflies before and I noticed them the other day. So maybe they were added when they went from like, when they switched down the Ranging 5. They've added all these little extra details in, like the particle effects. For example, the ones with Doctor in that last match, these leaves, the cute little fireflies. Yeah! Hi. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna go over here. Oh shit! I didn't see him breaking that. I thought he went under. That is 100% my fault. That is so dumb of me. I mean, he is really small, so I'm gonna give myself some credit. It's quite small and hard to see. But I did not see him break that pallet. That was 100% on me. Hi, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh gosh, Dwight. Is he on me? No. Oh! I don't even know where he is. I'm saying, oh, like I saw him. Oh, he's there. Oh, shit. Well, I'm doing good. I'm doing fun. We're thriving. We're on DVD. We're just. We're thriving and vibing with DVD. And. We're playing P100 Leon, which I haven't done for a while. But I do miss playing as Leon. I do miss him. So we're doubling back into a bit of Leon. I'm glad you've been okay. It's good to see. I'm guessing nurses is what just triggered there. It might not be. I could be completely wrong. Do you want healing? Literally just, I did not self care in front of you at all. I didn't even know you were behind me. In fairness. Where's, where is she hooked? In front of me. Stop that. Shit. Well, this point is we're stopping that progressing because it's just lost the same progress. Um, let's me go and get. Oh, hello. Are you still coming for me? I think you are. No? Maybe not? I'm glad you went okay, though. That's good to hear. Um, oh, oops. I mean, I could have tried to take more aggro. I'll be dropping into him! I could have, could have, probably should have tried to take more aggro from him now. Sorry, Dwight. I want to say it's not, it might not be nice. It, I don't actually know what it is that's triggering. Okay, no, it's definitely nurses because it's just triggered another one. So nurses, it's all I know he has is nurses. Okay. 
Over here then? No? We'll finish this first then, and then I'll heal you. He's probably going to head straight for this direction, to be honest, because of the gem popping. It is nurses. Yeah. Holy shit. I do not know my way around this map, really. You can just take that. Bye. Now, I feel like this is probably a mistake on my part. Didn't mean to get stuck on the locker. That was my bad. And poor planning on where I was running. Oh, really? In reality, that was my bad. Did not plan on hitting the locker. We should have healed first before doing the gen, I feel. So he wouldn't have known we were in that exact location. He might have had an idea, but he wouldn't have been 100%. He would have given us a slightly more time to have like, worked through and like, executed. Which sort of time. If he lingers a bit more around me, I can't get on hook myself. I mean, it, might, it probably won't be worth it, because I would die again, but you never know. It's worth giving it a go, right? Hopefully, the hatch spawns near her and she can escape. Do you know what? We did the challenge. We thrived. It took a little while to get the challenge done. I won't lie. Um, but we did it. What's the next one? 40,000? I can do that. We can get 40,000 blood points. Is it in one? No, it's just overall. Okay. I feel like that's something we can work towards getting done. There isn't meant to be three times blood points on. If I check, I don't even have... Yeah, three times the amount of blood points we earn. So, maybe we should bring some blood point offerings and try and boost the, the blood pointiness of things. Maybe that would be like a smart idea. I kind of want to go in as Nancy. Where is she? There she is. Go in as Nancy. We're bringing a bloody party streamer in. Because why not? At this point. You know, there's blood point bonuses already. We may as well profit even more on the, the blood point bonus. I probably should try and switch up what I'm running. So I kind of I get like a build that works for me and my playstyle. And I know it seems really selfish that I have self-care on, but I've used it to hide and disappear from killers mid-chase so many times that like I, I kind of rely on it sometimes when I'm being chased to just disappear around the corner. And I know I could carry a med kit or something that would be more helpful for the rest of the team. Which would usually would have been um 
the boon circle of healing because that's what I used to run all the time because it was helpful to not only me but the rest of my team whether I was playing with them and I knew who they were or they were just randoms that were in lobby that I queued up with so you know it kind of I probably should try and switch up what I'm using and try and find something that's more beneficial and helpful to everyone like even if it's something as simple as switching to reassurance so even if I can't get the unhook because the killer hits me I can reassure them so that they're not gonna their hook state's not gonna progress so that they can still stay within the match and not just die on first hook or even hit second stage on first hook I don't want to risk it. But that makes sense. Like, I don't want to risk losing my escape. Because it works for me. It works as an escape for me. So. So, I find a build that works for me. And, like, the way I play. And if I can discipline mid chase and heal, then that's what I'm going to go and try and do. But if I can also kill other people in silence in front of the killers, which I have done, I've directly under hooks, I've killed people with like the bullet on. It's, it's coming handy. To be fair, What the f is this gen? Is she had a brand new part, slay. We love that. Yeah. Okay, well. Thriving girl. I love the distortion. What do I lose a distortion for? I don't know what pack that is. I don't know what pack makes you lose a distortion token when a gen's finished. I probably should. I don't know why. These bubbles, right? That, the big circular bubble where she was hooked. I have died because of that so many times. Because I haven't seen the killer, like, bolting directly at me because they're inside of that like the the black smoke bubble thing oh i see it's like i have died to it so many times just primarily because i haven't seen them bolt for me but i also understand it helps people see where people have been hooked especially with the effects like Mindbreaker, where you are blinded when on a gen. Did she see me? I actually don't know what she wants. But I will sit on this gen. So, yeah. Anyway, let's go all around about the the little bubble, hook bubbles, over. Because sometimes they do get me killed. She's somewhere. I know she's somewhere around. She's gonna be running past me momentarily. I think. She's nowhere to hide. Okay. Mm. 
Alright, I'm gonna sit back on this job. This is enough reason to search for me handy. Nowhere to hide. She would have seen me directly where I was sitting. If um I didn't have distortion on when she kicked that gem. And granted I could have been in the locker she didn't check. But I don't know I don't know if know the hide reveals you if you're in a locker or not. Maybe killer instinct. I'm not a hundred percent sure. So for example then, if she was bolting directly at me, I wouldn't see her until like now when it cleared. So she could have been like right on me and I would have been none the wiser, other than the heartbeat coming up on the screen, but I wouldn't have been able to see what direction she was coming from. Because it would have blocked my visual of where she was. That was worth it. I was gonna say maybe it's Rancor and that's why I'm losing the distortion, but that doesn't do distortion tokens. I've, I've messed up. I waited too long to choose where to go. I should have just ran rather than trying to backtrack. But, you know, we learn from my mistakes. And my mistake was trying to backtrack instead of just commit to where I was going. I should have just ate the hatchet and ran with it. Probably would have got a lot further if I had done that. We win some, we lose some. She go for that? She is perfect. I'm gonna go for this gem. Punches is there. Okay, I don't know what gen she's on. Rebecca, I mean. I know what gen Rebecca's doing. I know she's over that way somewhere. She's unfortunately chasing the tail again. Oh, she's behind me. She's over that way. Okay. I don't know what I'm losing a distortion token to. I have no idea what perk that is. But every time one's completed, you see the auras. straight away just in case she came and then when we could have gone to get like the save so I didn't want to go straight away I am very intrigued I did my challenge I'm intrigued as to what perk she was running though so we need nowhere to hide bit of mama she's trying to generate it's fully repaired survivors within 60 meters of the completed generator be revealed so it's bit of mama okay But a murmur is seems useful. Again, like if I didn't have the distortion on, she would have seen my aura religiously throughout that match. Every time a gem was finished with her kicking the gems, she would have seen where I was. Which is why I run distortion so much. Much to like I say, 
because it was dismay, because I didn't want sound care. Bad bullet distortion. Doesn't scream helpful to the team. Um, but yeah, you know, we try our best. We're doing what we gotta do. <clears throat> and that is where I kind of enjoyed it. I don't know. So what did my challenge do? Was it heal myself? It was. I'm gonna heal myself. My health state. I can do that. I feel like my OBS is dying on me. It keeps like saying it's connecting to itself and or trying to connect. But it hasn't told me that it's disconnected. It just says it's trying to connect. And I feel like It's doing something. I don't know what it's doing, but it's doing something. Um, let me just check. It was to heal myself. Oh, that's like not the worst thing in the world, perk wise or challenge wise. I'm gonna pay Sable. Again, I'm gonna say it again. This outfit. With the green and the brown. It's... <laughs> I'd, it's giving Shaggy. You know, like... From Scooby-Doo. <laughs> and it sounds so dumb. But that's all I can see when I look at this outfit. All I can see is Shaggy. Um... Because obviously he has the brown trousers and the green top. And I know she's got the brown corset. Or the brown and black corset on. But she's wearing the green top. And she's got the brown trousers. And even like the the teal colour in the skirt. Like in the pleats. It's just given the colour of the mystery machine. So it, it literally is just giving shaggy. And I can't unsee it. It's all I've seen since I saw this outfit when she was released. And I kind of live for it. I kind of do like it. It is quite funny. Um, but yeah, as I said, it's been stuck in my head as that being Shaggy since, since I saw the outfit upon her release. So, enjoy. Enjoy that mental image of Sable being Shaggy. Um... You're welcome. <laughs> because it's all I have been able to see for ages. Um, I don't have any Bloodline offering. Do you know what? I want to go. Is it this one? Is it the Yamoka estate? What has... The eyeball. Not the eyeball. What are they called? The statues. The statues, that's what they are. Because, oh, there's, there's that little raccoon thingy with the tails, which is like a doll at first. That, do you know what I mean? You may have seen it on TikTok. I've found, I don't know what it's called. I cannot remember for the life of me what it's called. But, I want to go find him. I want to see him in game. So, I think it's on these maps. I, I generally do think it is on... This isn't the look, like... I, I found him before. I have found him. But, I want to go find him again. Because he's cute. And I want to see him. I kind of wish it was... Because I know there's an achievement to find him on PC. It classes as an achievement when you, when you find him. But he doesn't count as an achievement on console. Or at least on Xbox. He's not an achievement. Which is rather unfortunate. Because, you know, everyone loves a little achievement hunting. Um, I mean, I could go find him on PC. 
and get the achievement that way. But I'm kind of very reluctant to go play on PC. He did on PlayStation. So it's, it might just be Xbox that they haven't added him to yet. It could just be Xbox that they haven't added him to then. I don't know. I know he works on the Microsoft Store on PC. He shows up as um, an achievement because one of my friends has them and got it as an achievement. So I think it might just be the console edition unless they've updated it and re like worked it. But it's not this. I know it's only on the statue map, right? But these fireflies are what I was on about earlier. I don't remember seeing them before. Like, before they went to... Before they went to Unreal Engine 5. Anyway. Bye, Michael. You have fun. I'm gonna leave. Okay? Great. Yeah, before they went to Unreal Engine 5, I don't remember seeing the fireflies. They may have been there before. But I don't remember seeing them. So I feel like they're a new flourish that they've added. But I could be wrong. This top has a little heart on the back as well. I've never noticed it because of the hair. Anyway. Such an observant queen as always. Oh my god, speaking of queens. Have you seen that the game called Drag Her is no longer going to reach full development? Like, I know they said it, they did say, personally I'm not saying it's coming to Steam, it's going to be free. Because like the unreleased version is going to be available to play. And I can't wait to play it. I'm not going to lie. I really want to play it. Um, it's sad it's not going to be fully released. Which is unfortunate. But I'm excited to play it. And if I'm able to. And it lets me. I will. I will try and stream it. My OBS sometimes is a little shitty with me if I try to stream a PC game at the same time. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes it's like, you're doing too much and I don't like it. Don't know why, per se. I can stream PC DVD on like the high graphics and everything and it works fine. But sometimes the smaller games it has issues with and sometimes it doesn't. I actually don't know why. I don't have any like, analysis to it. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So, if it works, I'm going to try and stream it, because it looks fun, and I am excited to play it. Say I'm sad it's not going to come up, like, into a full release, like, state. Hi! No, that was so unfortunate. That was so unfortunate. Not him being, like... Right on the precipice. 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 I can't say that word. Like, literally, 99. He stalked me for like, a second. That I'm aware of. He may have stalked me for longer than that. I do not know. Do you know what? We've done four gems. Nearly. I don't know why she didn't finish that gem. We've nearly done four gems. Why did she not pop that gem? I'm so confused. Come on, girl, you grab this. There we go. But now we've done four gems. I mean, hopefully he doesn't come back and get me on her. No, he didn't come back. Okay, back again. We're thriving. Thank you. I'm gonna go find a different Ah Shit <laughs> Why? <laughs> no. Go away. Whoever that was with the flashlight, 
They're so kind. They distracted him so much. Give me another chance to leave. No, it didn't. He's still coming. Go away. Where are you? I know he's here somewhere. I just am not sure where. Anywho. Come here, Ada. No. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I can kill you. What was I meant to be doing? Health save. Was it a health state? I think it was a health state on myself. Yes. Okay, Ada. Thank you. Why is he not killing the Ada? Babes. What is that connection? Sweetheart. Okay. I mean, I might get my challenge done. I'm doing my health state now. Why did he just walk straight past Ada, though? And come for me instead. Because she's not exactly like hidden. She was about... Bitch. What the fuck? Okay. I mean, you, could, you do what you gotta do, Ada. You do what you need to do. Like, I barely understand. Apparently, okay, that did a health state. Why is she... I'm so baffled. So... I don't understand. If, if that's what you've got to do, you do you, Ada. You do whatever fits your boat home. I am a little, I'm very questionable as I could have. I mean, you do you. Do what you'll do, Ada. Hi, Michael. I don't know what someone did to this Ada. I don't know why she's doing what she's doing. Yeah. 
I thought they removed the ability to do what she was doing to Nick on Hook just then. I thought they stopped the ability to do that. But apparently not. Um. I don't know why she decided that was the route she was going to take. I generally have no idea. I'm very confused at why that's what she was going to do. Superior anatomy, brutal strand, know to hide, and fire up. I, I don't get it. I don't understand. I generally, I do not. I don't get why that's what she did. I don't get it. I'm not gonna, probably not going to get it, and I'm probably not going to understand why she decided to play that way. But it is what it is. We're going to move on. And just go from... Same. No idea why she did what she did. But if that's what she thought she needed to do, then, you know, she, she did what she had to do. You know, I understand. Sometimes, sometimes you need to. However, I, that is going to be my DVD stream for now. Um, I'm so sorry it was so short. Um, my connection, it, it keeps saying there's having issues with its connection, connectivity to like the connection or OBS and I'm not going to, I don't want to tempt fate and force it to like then die and crash on me. So I'm going to end here for now. I potentially will be back this evening with, I'm not sure what, I know I said I would be back yesterday evening and during yesterday's stream, but I will be back this evening. Um, I'm not going to go and nap like I've been doing every other day s since because um, it will get to like 5pm and I go have a nap and then I don't wake up until like 5am so I will be back this evening with something I'm not sure what yet but I will be back with something um, but I do thank you, all very much. Yeah, thank you all very much for being here I do appreciate you coming in just a chill vibe hang out um, but until then, I will see you all next time.